What up YouTube, it's The Beard from the ABC Duelists. Today we're gonna to be unboxing um, the Noble Knights of the Round Table box set. Um, I never, I've never really opened one of these so I don't really know what's in it, even though it kind of tells you. But I think it would still be cool to unbox this and see what's in it. All right, so first thing we got a nice play mat, or a game mat rather. I'm gonna use that for this. I think it makes more sense. Okay. All right. Getting into the actual contents of the box now. Is our cards. All right, so we're guaranteed, uh, looks like platinum rare cards. We have Noble Knight uh, Bedwear. Uh, we have Merlin. And then we also have Last Chapter of the Noble Knights. Uh, we have a power-up pack here. Um, kind of interesting to see what's in here. Oh, very nice. We have a Platinum Mystical Space Typhoon, Platinum Torrential Tribute, and a Platinum Forbidden Lance. Very nice. I know I'm going to be using those for sure. Uh, at least the MST and the Torrential, I don't know about the Lance. Let's see. I'm getting into this uh, structure deck here. If I can even open it, honestly. Got it. There we go. Alright, looks like we got some more Platinum cards here. We have a Ignoble Knight of High Land Salon. Uh, Art Gorius. Art. Yeah, Art Origus. King of the Noble Knights, uh, Sacred Noble Knight of King Art Origius, or how are you, I don't know. Uh, we actually have the Noble Knight himself, uh, Art Torgius. what, fucking, uh, we have a Noble Knight Gawain, uh, a Noble Knight of Black Land Stalin, a Noble Knight Medrout, a Noble Knight Gualchavad, uh, Noble Knight Dristan, uh, a Noble Knight Boars, looks like we got two of those, a uh, Noble Knight Peridur, Noble Knight Ichtar, we have a Gwenf Gwenifar, Queen of Noble Arms, uh, we have a Lady of the Lake, oh, we got a uh, really nice Platinum Honest here, very nice, a Knight de Greffer, a Dawn Knight. We have the Noble Knights of the Round Table. We have two of the field spells. Uh, Noble Arms Galatin. Looks like we got two of those as well. We have a Noble, Arm, Noble Arms Arfidutir. Uh, Noble Arms Caliburn. Looks like we got two of those. Uh, we have a, two Noble Arms of Destiny. Uh, we have one Noble Arms Excalibur. We have uh, a nice Platinum Dark Hole, a uh, nice Platinum Swords of Revealing Light as well, a nice Platinum Reinforcement of the Army for sure, a uh, Book of Moon, a Foolish Burial, a Release Restraint Wave, we also have Swords at Dawn, we have Avalon, we have Call of the Haunted, I know I'm definitely going to be using that just based on how it looks, um, Malevolent, Malevolent Catastrophe. Dimensional Prison, and then last but not least, we have a Solemn Warning in terms of cards. Um, looks like we also got a set of card sleeves here. Nothing too special about those, just a nice design on them of the Noble Knights, of the Art of the Field Spell, Noble, Arts, Noble Knights of the Round Table, looks like. Very nice. Um, and then last but not least, we have a, uh, a nice storage box here. Uh, that you gotta, looks like you gotta build it yourself. I mean, it is what it is. I mean, it's interesting. Definitely nice for holding cards, uh, commons or sleeves or anything like that. Um, probably not gonna build it here, uh, just to save some time, but, uh, pretty interesting box. I uh, hope they gave you some directions as well, how to assemble it. Um, but yeah, I mean, for $50, which is how much I spent on it, I mean, you're getting a pretty good deal. I mean, you get a, 
a mat which normally goes from you know I've seen mats to go anywhere from 25 to, to 30 35 dollars even uh, some nice sleeves and then uh, some very nice platinum cards I definitely do enjoy the look of these um, I'll definitely be using some of the uh, field and, or some of the spell and trap cards out of here uh, definitely um, very nice very nice look to all the cards for sure I really like how this MST looks for sure um, but yeah I mean if you want you know if you're looking for a mat or for just cards in general I definitely recommend picking this up um, if I had to give it an overall I'd say maybe like a four out of five maybe I mean like I said I, I wouldn't really use this deck based on what is all in it but I mean with the right cards anything could be powerful so um, otherwise uh, that's it for this video if you just want to leave a like uh, or comment in the, in this you know comments below or uh, feel free to subscribe to us as well if you're new here otherwise uh, stay tuned for the next video see ya